In this tutorial I will show you 14 CapCut tips and tricks to muster on CapCut PC and Mac. By following these you can make your editing next level. Please let me know which tips and tricks you like in the comments. See the preview. Tip 1. Organize your clips. If you organize your folder in a sequence, you can easily import your project without wasting your time and give more time to make your editing better. All my video clips are stored into video folder. Click the folder. In the music and sound effects folder, all music and sound effects are stored. I have stored recordings here. I am storing all edited clips here. Then the export folder where I am storing all final save project. This is empty now. Upload folder. After doing final check and edit, I will put the complete edited project here to upload on YouTube. In that way you actually can organize your video clips so you can get access quickly. Tip 2 You will learn how to make animated title. I will show you how you can make your content attractive. By adding animated title, select text and move playhead and go to animation and scroll down. I will add this one showing down. Change animation duration from 5 seconds to more. This is the an animation adding outcome. Go to animation out. You can give any of the animation you like. Add animation out slide right. Click on it. Change duration. Increase duration for make this title looks better. Results. Tip 3 How to Pointing Fix things If you want to pointing something in your video I want to pointing this headphone You can do it easily Go to sticker tab and click on it Under sticker You will find so many options pop up Go to emphasis Click on it and bring this one up to main video clip Use scale to resize the arrow. Rotate the arrow. Reposition the arrow to pointing headphone. Pointing for moving things. I'll show you how you can pointing on moving things. How to pointing this moving bus. Click on sticker tab and scroll down. Click on emphasis. Scroll down. Click on this blue arrow and adjust into timeline. Use scale to resize this arrow. Select the stickers on Timeline and go to Tracking tab. Click on Motion Tracking tab. Click Start. Wait patiently. Tracking completed. Tick the circular video. Hover over the clip and click on plus button to bring the clip into Timeline. Select the video. Under Video go to Mass. Choose the circle. In the preview area circular shape will come. Adjust clip by holding any of the four handles. I think this one is perfect. 
a border around this circular crop. Go to Basic tab. Scroll down. Go to Canvas. Choose Color. Expand so you will find more color options. Choose this color. On the top you will see one message pop up which notify the background has been added to the clip. Then create compound clip or use Alt plus G. Go to mask and choose circle. You need to adjust this border to perfectly match with the video clip outer line. Then increase the border by dragging any of the handle. Go to basic tab again, so you can easily move this cropped video any position. Tip 5 add multiple background clips. If you want to show few clips in your educational, finance or any blogs this tips is really helpful, so you can actually explain multiple clips to your videos. Bring clip into timeline. Move up the circular crop video art, adjust all the clips. Your video should look like this. Tip 6 Split Scene First select clip Right click you will see Split Scene here Click on it Split Scene features are working Wait patiently This clip is now split into 4 clips This is a very helpful features for editing If you have a big clips Tip 7 Add Transition On the left side top click on Transitions Click on this drop down Scroll down and go to Blur Move this playhead in boop one to clip split. Drop the square blur in between to split clips. On the right side panel details of this transitions are available. Increase the duration of this transition for better results. I will add the same transitions for other three clips. Click apply all. <laughs> Tip 8 Add Sound Effects Go to Audio then go to Sound Effects Many sound effects are available In the search box write waves Multiple wave sound effects will come This sound symbol means you can play from here and listen Bring the sound effects into timeline Run copyright check Make sure your clip length more than one min otherwise copyright check cannot be possible. Add additional clip to make the clip duration more than one min. Run the copyright check again. Copyright check pass so you can use the sound effects. Select sound effects and then split. Copy sound effects. Paste into other two transitions. Do the same thing. Play the player. You can see all the basic under audio tab. Under Speed tab you can easily find the times and duration of this sound effects. Tip 9 How to add music on CapCut I will show you how to add music on CapCut easily. Go to Media and Import. Bring the music into Import section. Hover over on Music Track and click on Plus button to add to track into timeline. So right now music added into video clip. On the right panel you will see detail of the information. Play the music from player.
Jonah used music from CapCut audio section. Please use copyright free music. Tip 10 How to Extract Audio. I will show you how you can extract audio from your video clips. Move your playhead at the beginning of this clip. Select Video Clip. Right click and then click this Extract Audio. You see audio is extracted from clip. Tip 11 You will learn shortcut. You can find shortcut from the menu. Click on it. Go to help and shortcut. Other way you can also find the shortcut. Go to top right and find shortcut. Click on it. All the shortcut for the timeline. Click on player to see the shortcut. Click on basic to see the shortcut. Last one others. Add tip 12 how to add favorites. Add favorites to text template, stickers, sound effects, effects, transitions and filters to get these quickly. This is looks like a star symbol. After click on it, this will turn yellow which means this one added on favorites. See one example go to stickers. Go to emphasis. If you like any of the stickers just click on the star. Go to favorites you will find the arrow. Some b-roll footage above main clip. Bring clips into timeline from import section. Move all the clips up. Donut resize the clip and give little gaps in between to clips. Tip 14 How to export your video clip in 4K quality or your edited project on 4K quality. Top right click on export. Title. Give the file name to save. Export to which folder you actually want to save the file. Next resolution. Give for K resolution. Bit rate choose recommended. Code SH to 6 for use. Format MP4. Framerate 30 FPS. Don't. Check this box. Export audio. So you need to uncheck caption exporting. When you first time export your edited project after updated or install CapCut. From here you can see this video. Duration is to minute 20 second and size. Click on export. All the export information is available here. Open the folder and click on it. You will find your exported file here. Please like and subscribe. See you in next tutorial. Thanks for watching.